Uh, hey guys, so I just finished Four of Sevens on my final, and I just remembered that the final issue for Batman the Imposter came out. And what can I say? It's another masterpiece. This is an alternate, it's kind of a DC Black label, full of alternate story on, you know, on Batman being younger. And it, in my opinion, it is a lot better than Batman Earth One. So basically, it's a really good story. And there are a couple reasons. The first is, like I say, the art. The art in this story looks really gorgeous. I mean, just let me see. Let's just look at it. Just look. This isn't just you know a regular bland comic book. This looks amazing. It has amazing panels. It also has amazing action. Just look at it. It's beautiful. And it also has a story on. Who um who's the villain? In case you guys don't know, some someone is impersonating Batman and is framing him for murder. And Batman needs to solve this crime, and like and basically it's a very solid series, mini series. Like there's nothing I can really talk about it because it's really good. But like I said, great action, great story, and great art. I'll just show you one more time. Uh, hold on. So it kind of really. Like, if you, I don't know if you can notice, but I just love how this kind of parallels with the one below, down below. And you see, this is kind of like a little inversion. So, I mean, that's really, there's not much I can say. Just a really solid story. So this story, well, what can I say? It's a 10 out of 10. Go read it if you have time. All right. See ya. Sorry for the short review.